peeps, you would not guess. I just made both English and Spanish monologues without the headset on. I'm so fucking pissed. I just spent like 20 minutes just talking to myself without recording it. Well, just recording the road, but not me. Oh my god. Anyhow. So, let me get started again. What's up, YouTubers? Hope you're all doing well today. And... Finally gone home. So... Uh, where was I? Oh yeah. I haven't had a chance to, to actually give a little bit of myself to you guys. Not in the nasty way, you dirty people. But in the uh, aspect of knowledge wise. Dumbass. A little bit of myself about why I love, mo why I got into motor vlogging. And some other bits. So, I started motor vlogging. Back in December, two years back in December, and I was on vacation. I didn't know what, to, I didn't have anything to do, so I started YouTubing, watching vids as a normal YouTube, YouTuber would do, and I came across a motor bloggers vid. It was Chase on Wheels. What the fuck is wrong with you, boy? Um, watched his first vid that was recommended to me by YouTube, of course. Uh, started watching more of his vids. I liked it. Kept watching more of the uh, Yummy R6, Psycho Cruiser. Uh, I already said Chase on two wheels. He was the first guy that I was watching. What else? Uh, Adrian Nickelodeon. Lead pin. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? I said all the names before on the previous part, but since it's not gonna sound, man. Come on, go! We're dumbass. So, several other motor vloggers, so I. I lacked it and I was like, why not? I commute to work on two wheels. And I was like, fuck it. Let me get myself a camera. Start trying out the camera. Start recording. Start finding the best position for the camera. After a few weeks, I bought a mic. Actually, months, <laughs> actually. And then I started recording audio. And. I got hooked from there. Now I got two cameras where you can, guys can watch me and you can watch the road. So, it's been grown. And thanks to Chase on Two Wheels, I started motor vlogging. I motor vlog 
I do two move two moto vlogs, uh, English and Spanish. Since I'm in Mexico, I moto vlog for people here in Guadalajara. Well, not Mexico, so all Mexicans watch my videos. Since not everyone speaks English. And from there, English for all those people that live in Cali, where I'm from, where I grew up. Oh yeah. That's why I do bilingual blogs. One in Spanish, one in English. Please, please, never ask me to model vlog for you in Spanglish. Because that gives me a headache. Literally, gives me a headache. So yeah, also, I'm from Cali. I live most part of my life in Cali. In a small town called Fillmore. Where I grew up. Where I started writing incognito. Kept it a secret from my parents for 13 years. I started uh, writing before they even know. Because they didn't want me to ride a bike. But then I got myself a bike. And then they got screwed. And now they're going to be mad. Because I didn't tell them. So, uh, I started off riding my own bikes when I came here to Mexico because all the other bikes that I rode were lent from friends and all that shit because I couldn't buy myself one because my parents would have made me sell it. So now start off with an Italica GM 150 which is an enduro bike start off with that bike tried that bike for 98 Kawasaki ER5 naked ER5 which is a 500cc from there Bye. Uh, God damn, she broke my concentration. <laughs> uh, I traded the Kawasaki for a uh, ninety-seven Honda CBR nine hundred double R. I only enjoyed that bike about a month because I spun the uh, crank bearings. No, sorry, not the crank bearings, the uh, rod bearings. I immediately bought an FRI. And as soon as I finished repairing the 900, I traded both the 2001 F4i Honda and the 900 for this baby. Which man, I'm in love with this baby. I don't think I'm going to get rid of her. She's very good to me. She's treated me very well. And just because of that, I did had to make some major repairs and all that shit. So this is a small portion of me. There'll be more. But that's considered this as a start off. So after saying that. Here's the uh,
trivia question. First five people to guess get my very first production of decals. How about that? Very first five people to get the right answer. But this only applies to the people that don't know me. Which is here it goes. I'm not trivia because you're not gonna know. <laughs> it's a guess. I want you guys to guess. How old am I? For the first five people to guess correctly, I will give them a decal. How about that? Post your answer below. And on the next video, I'll post the winners. So, yep. Also, if you have other questions you want to know about me, uh, post your questions in the comments below, and and I'll add them to the list to the second part of several parts of myself how about that well thank you all for watching and hope you all have a nice rest of the week see you soon peace